Hey guys, it's Alex Jirachi, the Student Director of Leadership LLC. And as you know, coming up are the applications to apply to come back to lead team. Um, in order to come back to lead, you need to apply for one of five different positions. It's the only way you can come back. And I know it can be a little intimidating knowing which one you want to apply to. So I'm going to give you a little bit of information, hopefully get you a little bit more informed. First up, we have mentor team. What mentors do, you have a mentor, or you had a mentor, so hopefully you know. Mentors, um, they get seven different freshmen and they are the buffer uh, to them to acclimate to lead and to acclimate to Baylor. You're sort of the first line of defense for them. Anytime they need resources, you'll be there, you'll meet with them weekly. You're just there to be a mentor. Next up is service team. If you have a heart for serving and you have a heart for helping others, this is generally the team for you. Service team helps us get our 15 hours of required service for lead, and you'll be in charge of setting up events, going to events, and making sure people are doing the work that they're supposed to be doing. Next up is outreach team, and outreach is for people who enjoy building community, large events such as our formal, or the salsa for salsa, or even the karaoke night. If you enjoy setting up large events, this is a team for you to join. Next up is assessment team. Assessment team is for people who like giving input or they're very contextual leaders and they want to improve things. Assessment team is really big for freshmen to be able to communicate with upperclassmen and staff members and you'll be setting up forums and generally allow feedback to be given to improve our program. Last but not least is communications team. If you're really big on social media, if you like taking pictures, if you like helping me make these videos, then you should join communications team. Really excited to see what team you decide joining, and if you have any questions, feel free to email me, I'm always available. Thanks.